Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another tutorial. Today I will be showing how to disable driver signature verification on Windows 10. And this method also works for people using Windows 8 and 8.1. Basically, all 64-bit versions of Windows require digitally signed drivers. And the problem that a lot of users face that are looking up this video is that many devices don't have signed drivers and while this will increase the security of your computer by providing more of a check to see what drivers you're installing or not it could be a nuisance and it could cause problems on your computer so if you're not that concerned about the security of driver verification then this video is for you so the first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to get to our troubleshooting menu and how we're going to do this is we're going to go on our start button and then under power click on that and then hold down the shift key and click on restart at the same time so just hold down the shift key when you click on the restart button Okay, so now we can see we can choose an option. Select Troubleshoot, so left click on that. And then under Troubleshoot, left click on Advanced Options. And then now that we're under Advanced Options, go under Startup Settings. And before we click Restart here, we can see that it's, so it says we are going to disable driver signature enforcement, which is exactly what we are trying to do in our situation here. So we're gonna left click on Restart. The computer is just going to restart at this point in time. Now it says press a number to choose from the options below. Use number keys or function keys F1 through F9. So it appears that if we look on the screen here, disable driver signature enforcement is number 7. So you can either click on F7 or just click on the number 7, which I'm going to do. And the computer at this point is going to restart and once you be back into Windows everything should be okay. So I hope this video helped you out, and I will see you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.